Fuel Cell Energy is a company in Torrington, Connecticut, developing new energy technologies. Producer Tony Dunn and videographer Dave Fraser take us inside the plant to learn more. What we're really seeing around the world is greater appreciation of a power generation that's continuous, that can be right where it's needed. And then, oh, by the way, if you can do that in a very environmentally friendly way, that's even better. And that's really what fuel cells offer. Power right where you need it, delivered efficiently in an environmentally friendly manner. We uh, actually came to Torrington because it was a former hub of manufacturing activity. And uh, that continues. Uh, we're currently employing 250 people in our shop. And from that production facility, we service markets around the world. We have uh, customers all over the world, and the reason being is that this technology, this fuel cell technology, makes electricity with higher fuel efficiency than any technology that's uh, baseload power generation technology in the world. So uh, we're making electricity by, um, uh, by electrochemical reaction rather than combustion. Uh, and we do so with higher fuel efficiency. So it leads to lower carbon emissions uh, with really almost zero uh, pollution. We're taking hydrogen and oxygen and combining them and making water. And in the process of doing that, we generate electricity and heat, which we can then use and sell for our customers. Actually, our product is very fuel flexible. It can run on natural gas or biofuels. Some of our customers, they generate a methane gas as part of their byproduct. They have, that's a waste for them. They need to flare that off. That costs them money to rid themselves of that waste. By utilizing our product, they can use that as the fuel source for the power plant, thereby generating electricity and heat and uh, getting rid of their waste. What we do here in Torrington is we manufacture the power producing portion of the power plant. It's called the fuel cell module. The module is comprised of primarily four fuel cell stacks. Each one of those stacks contains 400 individual fuel cell layers or bipolar plate packages. Those packages contain the electrodes and the matrices, which are the core power producing component of the product. The technology we use is well suited for megawatt class applications. So one megawatt of power, just to put it in perspective, is adequate to power about 800 average size U.S. homes. So an ideal customer for us is someone who's a big power user and they use it continuously. One of our earliest uh, clients for one of our smaller units, um, 300 kilowatts, was Yale University. Uh, and very recently we deployed a um, megawatt class fuel cell at Central Connecticut State University. The fuel cell power plant provides about a third of their power and it's designed that if the surrounding electric grid does go down, that fuel cell power plant will still be producing power. If you're an operation that, that's 24 hours a day, say a manufacturing plant or a government military base, power reliability and security is very important for you. You, you can't afford to lose power. So the advantage of distributed generation and of an example with the fuel cells is you're providing that power right on site. So if, if the grid, the electric grid goes down, you still have a power option. We have, uh, uh, as I mentioned, an international and global client base. Um, sometimes people are a little bit surprised that we're actually manufacturing here in New England for deployment around the world to leading economies like Germany and Korea and Japan. And indeed, it's a source of pride for us to be able to do that. And when you think about some of the uh, dynamics going on around the world, countries trying to move away from certain types of central power generation, co uh, countries facing challenges with transmission and distribution, particularly in urban areas, we are a solution that we feel fits very well with the power generation needs facing the world today. It's a pleasure to be part of an ongoing solution for our, the country and the world's energy needs. Uh, we're not the sole solution, but we certainly are uh, capable of being a major contributor.